All right, what is up, YouTube? Um, back with another commentary. Uh, I'm, I'm just talking about the Bison, all right? Um, the Bison was banned for league matches, UMG Align. Hasn't been banned from game battles and game battles tournaments yet. But um, I, I was kind of like, there's good things to it and there's bad things. You know, the good things is I hate the Bison. I hated getting destroyed by the Bison when you should have an easy kill. And it, it was horrible. But the bad thing about it is we had Burns. He was he was a big supporter of the Bison. He really liked it. Um, one, the only reason I liked... I like that the Bison was allowed because he used it. He did good with it. Uh, he could get he could put, he could make some big plays with it, and uh, he'd get in a lot of teams' heads with it. He'd be like, "Yo, this kid only uses the Bison," and a lot of people would think about it. Uh, honestly, we'd get so many complaints about it. But you think about it, that's that's a good thing. That's not something I had to worry about. So if if I wasn't getting killed by the Bison and he was killing people with it, I I didn't care. I didn't care. You're playing to win. You're doing whatever you have to. Um, there's no you're not here to make friends or do anything like that. Uh, I just want to win. The, the end result is you want to win. That's all it comes down to. If you're, if everybody's playing for money, there's no friends. I mean, yeah, you can be friends out of the game, but in the game, I mean, when we're actually playing, competing, I'm not going to be sitting there, yo, I'm going to I'm gonna put myself at a disadvantage or not try to put myself at an advantage, just stuff like that, um, just to help you out. That's something that everybody's going to want to try to do, put yourself at an advantage. And, um, yeah, so pretty much, any, anyways, um, the Bison being banned is just, Jesus, I know you guys have been killed by it or seen people kill it, be killed by it. It's, it's just all these YouTube videos. It wasn't insane. You can map people across the map. It was kind of like an AR submachine gun that could kill you and dominate you up close. It was the craziest patch. Um, other than the only crazier patch I can remember, if you guys ever played MW2, uh, the Model 1887. Jesus, those things were one-shot kill across the map. They were shotguns, and they would just one-shot kill you, and you could have dual wielding. And that, that, those were crazy. Those were OP as hell. But um, these things, it wasn't at, that it was OP as hell. It was just really, really strong. It had a really big advantage. You had a very, very big advantage. So it's like, it didn't. It wasn't the best. It wasn't in COD's best interest to keep that. So they, uh, Infinity Ward said they're going to make a patch, but it is banned. I don't know if they're going to have a banned at Niagara until then. Yeah, hopefully they have a banned at Niagara. Um, that way we could keep um, playing it. or I mean, not keep playing it. It will be banned at Niagara. We don't have to worry about Bisons, and it will be just all raw gun skill whenever you get gunfights and smarts. Um, that's something that really plays a part in it. In it. And uh, that's just I, that's one thing I can't, that's one thing I think about a lot. And another thing I was I was thinking about is why is why is this game not as big as Halo? Um, you look at uh, Halo Two, Halo Three. Those games were selling out. I know I just kind of went on a tier and tight changed the topic completely. But I'm saying why is why is Halo Two and Halo Three so much bigger than Call of Duty Ghost was or Black Ops Two was? And those games, I know it wasn't the Ghost isn't the best game. Black Ops Two is really fun in my opinion. But I'm saying those were like four or five years ago. Now we have uh, a lot of things like social networks, we have Facebook, Twitter, I don't know nobody uses Facebook, but Twitter, a lot, people can network, social networks, we, we have a lot of social networks, we have, um, we can live stream now, easier to live stream, you know, everybody can live stream almost, uh, the internet, everybody's on the internet, and it's just crazy, like, before they used to have uh, Halo on USA TV, and just things like that, why do we not have that, why do we not, as, I mean, we're getting that with esports, and we're going to be on ESPN too, but, I mean, uh, with X Games, but why did we not have that before? Why did we not have uh, COD? COD, in my opinion, everything should improve. I know it's different games, but esports should improve as a whole. You should see uh, one game dies out, those people go watch another game and just stuff like that. Uh, I, that's why one thing I wasn't, I was questioning about, uh, about why has the viewership just not grown every single game, every single year um, since Halo 2 to now. Halo 2 is bigger than we are now, and that's crazy. I know it was a really good game, so there's no disrespect to the actual game. Um, that game was really fun to play, really fun to watch, and that's how I felt about Black Ops 2. It was probably one of the best Call of Duties um, to ever play, and I, I only realized that because this game came out, right? I didn't play Black Ops 2 the whole time, and after this game comes out, I'm just like, damn, I miss Black Ops 2. That's that's how you learn. Like that's how you realize what what went wrong with this game and um, just stuff like that. So that's just one thing I was always wondering about. Like why are we not a bigger game? Why is this? Why do we not have more viewers? Why do we not have more support? Why don't? Why is half the the community of gaming optic? I mean, uh, uh, the COD gaming scene optic fans. Uh, that's just something I don't agree with. Not agree with, but I don't understand why is the game. If anything. Um, shouldn't they just find teams that they like or, or anything? Even when Optic wasn't winning, that's sorry about that. Even when Optic wasn't winning, um, they were still all Optic fans, and that's just something I I was always crazy about. I was I was kind of interested. It was 
more than half of the fans are Optic fans, and it's just weird. But um, anyways, I guess they really, maybe because of Nate Shot, he brought them all from sniping to now. But it is what it is. Anyways, hopefully you guys like my commentary and me rambling on. Uh, leave a like, comment down below, and I'll see you guys later. Peace.